October, but first we still got a lot, a lot of things going on. A lot of things going on here at the school district as, as we come to a close in October. But I got to give a few shout outs first. Uh, first one to our uh, high school tennis team. They were the 4A area champs. Congratulations. They had a season of 21 and 7, undefeated in district. Uh, but this past week they went up against Tulsa Midway and will not advance, but they had a great, great season. Did they? Good. They absolutely did. And last week when we were here, we talked about the marching band as they got or preparing to go on to competition. Mm -hmm. They received all ones, superior rating. They were moving on, and they will be competing in Cal Allen on October the 30th. So congratulations to all our band. Yes, congratulations to the band and all the other sports as well. Absolutely, and, and we've got some regional qualifiers from our cross-country female team. And they'll be moving on to uh, run at Corpus Christi at Regionals on October the 25th. Mm -hmm. That's Monica Vetta, Michelle Hernandez, Analia Gonzalez, Alexis Silva, Abby Cohn, Fiona White, and Desiree Vetta. All right, well, good. Yeah, so we've got a lot going on. And, you know, I've heard on the radio this week you've been announcing homecoming and That's homecoming right. activities, and we've got a, a full office here of yes, homecoming activity people. Well, let's uh, let's uh, bring over Miss Barnett this morning, and she can talk to us about uh, about homecoming and what to expect uh, today with the parade and the bonfire. Miss Barnett, good morning. How are you doing? I'm doing good, Mario. Welcome back. Okay, so hi, everybody. I would like to um, invite our community to gather along the parade route to cheer on our students. Um, the Uvalde homecoming parade lineup will start at 430. They'll Good. start closing the roads down at 430. Um, the parade doesn't begin till 6. The parade route being Opal to Getty, ending at the Honey Bowl visitor side with our traditional bonfire. Mm -hmm. You know, that's one of the questions I get all the time in text messages. Uh, what time is the parade? So we'll mm -hmm. say that once more. Six o'clock is when it's uh, scheduled to start. Uh, it's great. It's exciting to have uh, the traditional events take place uh, in Uvalde. Uh, love that small town community feel. And uh, what, what other information can you share about the uh, homecoming dance? Okay, so the homecoming dance is scheduled for Saturday, October 23rd in the Uvalde High School cafeteria from 7 to 11. Um, the ten dollar it's ten dollar entry free that goes to the class of 2022. Mm -hmm. um, it is only open to Uvalde High School students. Okay. So um, yeah. We will prom dress code will be in effect. Um, so if any students have questions about the dress code, they're encouraged to ask one of the high school admin. Okay. Well, that's good. And now this morning you have some uh, some special guests with you here. Um, Who's here with us this morning? Okay. Yes, joining me this morning are homecoming queen and king candidates. Um, I'd like them to introduce themselves and the organiz organizations they represent. All right. Okay. So, well, who's going to come over first uh, and introduce themselves? Uh, we have six individuals we'll here with us. let the queen candidates come yeah, first. Yeah, we'll let the queen candidates come first. Good morning. How are you? Good morning. How are you? Doing well. Talk to me. So, um, I'm Abigail Cohn. Um, things I'm involved in, I'm student council and class of 22 president. I run cross country and track, and I'm a captain of the soccer team. This year, I'll get to represent soccer as their sweetheart. Nice. Well, thank you for that information. Yes, thank you. Um, I'm Megan Samaripa. I have played soccer for UHS since my freshman year, and I have been trio all throughout high school, which is what I'll be representing as sweetheart. Nice. All right. Um, my name is Ariana Diaz. I have been sp a, sports med a sports medicine trainer for the past three years, which is what I'll be representing for my sweetheart position. I am the senior class vice president, Stuco par parliamentarian, and a member of National Honor Society. Fantastic. Thank you for sharing that with us this morning. Now, uh, before we introduce these next gentlemen, this is the first time we are having a, uh, a homecoming king. Absolutely candidate. is. Yeah. yeah. So we had some student body representatives uh, meet with some administrators, or administrators and school board members, and they asked, why don't we have a homecoming mm -hmm. king? Yeah. And we had no good response other than <laughs> it sounds like a good idea to do. So, well, yes, making this is the first here, year. Making history. So, yeah. yeah, step right up. Step on up. Come on over. Our first candidate is? Hello. I'm I'm Jaime Cruz, and um, it's an honor to be yeah. <laughs> the first ever uh, king candidate. So, But um, I've been a sports, med for, a sports med trainer for the past four years, which I'll be representing as Bo. 
I'm the Class of 22 Secretary, the National Honor Society Historian, and also a part of Student Council. Great. Next we have... Uh, I'm Tony Hernandez. I play football, which I'll be representing for homecoming, and I also run track and do boxing. Nice. All right. And... Hi, hello. My name is Claudio Sandoval. Um, I am the president of the Honor Society. I'm uh, the secretary of HOSA, which stands for Health Occupation Students of, Ameri of America. Um, I'm a member in band, and I will be the bow for HOSA this evening. Great. Well, thank you. Thank you all for uh, taking the time to visit with us and talk to us about a little bit about who you are and what you represent. And uh, best of luck to all of you tomorrow. Yeah, it's a great group. We're very excited, very proud of these young individuals. And look for them in the parade tonight. Absolutely, look for them in the parade. So tonight, have you, you been practicing your waves? Yeah, yeah. 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 Wave and smile, you know. Yeah. You got it, cup and wave. Cup. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. Well, fantastic. So I encourage the community to come out tonight and support uh, our uh, homecoming parade. Mm -hmm. uh, I'd like to see a sea of maroon. That would be great. In uh, our Pre-game activities will start at 6 mm -hmm. uh, tomorrow night, and uh, our halftime activities will have the homecoming court, the freshman uh, and sophomore and junior uh, class representatives, and then we will uh, crown the homecoming queen and king this year. Fantastic. Well, Dr. Harold, thank you so much for taking the time to talk to us. Anything else you want to share with us before we go? Yeah. One other thing. Uh, Parents, if after the football game tomorrow night, our marching band will be doing their show after the football game. So stick around for a great performance by our, our uh, Uvalde High School marching band. Great. All right. Thank you all for stopping by. All right, Mario, thank you all for having right. us. Thank you. 7.36 the time. It's Coyote Country, 104.9 FM.